Hi, I'm Kieran from ISB Mobility. I'm here today to show you and demonstrate the Floor 2 curb stair lift. Uh, been very popular for many years. Um, all this kind of updated its technology um, and um, made by ThyssenKrupp, so very big brand. So, get straight into it. Um, it has a seat and footrest in, interlinked, so once you push down the seat, the footrest comes with it and the two arms just pop down like so. The joystick on this is a good size. It's uh, the, uh, about two and a half, three inches height, so you can either use the palm of your hand or your finger. So I'm just gonna pop into the stair lift, so I sit in to the seat, and on this particular chair, you have the push down foot plate, so just push it down, and the foot plate goes ahead. All these lifts now are sensored, uh, so, if there was uh, any blockages in the way, it would cut out. So I'm going to press the stair lift to go up. So to negotiate here, what we have is a 180 degree parking bend. So the floor two can go external and internal. This particular model is going internal. So we're negotiating a 180 degree parking bend. So it's going to go slower around the bend. But um, once it picks up the straight section of track, it'll just go a little bit quicker uh, to get you upstairs as quick as possible. So this one here has a singular rail. It's three inch in width and diameter. And as you can see here, there's legs on different sections of the stairs. And that'll all depend on your staircase. The measuring technology of these now is by CAD drawing. So come out, we take photographs and uh, they're made to measure the stairs. So we're just going down here again now because of the, uh, the bend that's coming up. So this one now has a 90 degree bend on the uh, this side here. So it's just going to slow down. So we'll swing around this way. And then it quickens up again here at the south of the section. This also has the cutout feature, so if my feet was left in the middle of the stairs and I put my foot down, it would cut out. So, just to show you the safety feature, and then it'll run on again once it's clear. So, on this particular staircase, we have a 90 degree top part. So, when it gets to the top of the stairs, sometimes you have the uh, sitting in your own home for it to be parked at the top of the stairs rather than finishing at the nose. So this is just the night we parked so come around the corner and it stops automatically at the top. So you're nice and safely at the top and it cuts out itself. This way it's on the charge point and it's uh, nice and safe. If it wasn't on the charge point and you stopped it beforehand, say you took your hand off it too soon, the lift would let you know that it's not on the charge point by bleeping. So, as you can hear there now, it means I'm not, we're not on the charge point. So always make sure you go to the end of the stair lift. Because it cuts out itself. And I this mount. So, I'm just gonna put on the foot rest, I'm pushing my arms up. Them up and then just fold them. Just stay lift up. This also has hand remote controls at the top and the bottom of the stairs, so you can always call it to you whether you're in the bedroom or down in the kitchen, it'll work, work off radio frequency. And so your stair lift will always be there waiting for you wherever you may need it. Thanks for watching and listening. Thank you.